Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video guys to any of you having a Kia Optima. If you guys have a Kia Optima and you want to see guys how to clean throttle body stay with us, we will cover that today. Super important to do that. You can see that throttle body guys difference is day and night difference. Uh, throttle body that's dirty can make your Kia Optima to uh, rev high guys, uh, to have unstable idle to have unstable engine operation, have engine light on, even misfires, lean codes, all kind of stuff. Because it can be sticking, it may not be sealing good, it may not be responsive. So we will explain guys what needs to be done to actually clean that throttle body. Now, that key Optima guys, especially if you have the 2.4 GDI engine guys, we will have more than 300 mechanical videos. We will be taking the whole car apart, we will explain how to fix practically anything on that engine and all that guys will be on our second channel World Mechanics. I'm going to talk about that in just a little bit. Why we make all these videos guys? Because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Now, something else guys, if you need to buy any throttle body, cleaner, any parts, tools for a really good price and quick shipping, that's where we get all our tools and parts from. We'll share the links in the description of the video below, so please guys check it out, all that will be shared there for your convenience. So. All the mechanical videos on that Kia Optima will be on our second uh, cha channel, World Mechanics, check it out. And if you want to see electrical videos, diagnostics and all that stuff will be on our electrical car repair live channel. All that will be listed there guys, while we do all that, so we can save you as much money as we can. We're going to clean half of it and demonstrate guys the difference before and after so you can see what we are talking about. Okay, you can see what uh, you can use, throttle body or air intake cleaner. This is amazing stuff. Okay, we'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get it from. So uh, we'll go ahead, use that. Okay, and now we are going to go ahead, apply on a quad. Okay, apply on a quad. Oh, we can spray on the throttle body too. You always use gloves. Why uh, uh, gloves? Um, also use guys eye protection. Another thing that you need to use. Okay, you need to make sure that you're you don't have open flame, fire. Okay, hot engine. Have fire extinguisher on the side, and you will see how terribly bad that throttle body is, guys. Okay, you can see so far. Okay, how it cleans it. It makes it really nice. Okay, we'll need to spray more. Let's go ahead, clean it now. What we can do, okay? We can, we need to clean everywhere, guys, okay? But we want to do half, and we want to show you the before and after results, okay, from that cleaning. Okay, I will keep that, that thing open, okay? And you will need to clean the edge of that flap, if, okay, because often you will have carbon buildup on that flap and what will result into guys, okay, if it's not clean, okay, it can get, it, it can be sticking, it can be leaking more air than it should, that can lead to uh, revving high, also it can lead, okay, to unstable engine operation, check it out, okay, that's carbon buildup guys, so we're going to spray more here. And you can even spray on the throttle body, but we just don't want to make a mess here now everywhere. And sometimes when you spray on the throttle body, we can get it on the camera. So you can see how it cleans the lip of that flap there, guys. So let's see now, okay, what it looks like when we clean half of it compared to the other half. Okay, let's close it and you will see the difference, guys. Okay, now that will make everything run smoothly because if you have dirty throttle body, it can be sticking, it cannot be closing all the way, it cannot be responsive, and as a result, okay, you may get all kind of troubles, guys, and you may have unstable uh, idle, unstable vehicle operation, engine lights, misfires, all kind of stuff. So, it's important, guys, just get everything everywhere, we want to just do half so we can show you, okay, how good it will look on that Kia Optima, once you clean the throttle body, okay, now, again, it's very important, open that that valve okay that uh, flap and check it out now let me show you on this side how we clean it it's nice and smooth on this side you have all that carbon buildup that make uh, makes the throttle body sticking it may not close all the way and that can cause unstable operation as well and you can see day and night difference that throttle body guys so uh, that's how you clean the throttle body on Kia Optima if you have any questions let us know don't hesitate guys hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time